Okay, so remember in the last video, we were able to store chat messages into our database. But we still had one problem in that when you refresh the browser window, the chat messages are lost, that we're not retrieving them from the last session. Okay, so let's see how we can do that in this video. So the first thing that we need to do is let's head over to our server.js. So anytime that a user has connected automatically, so that for callback for that is inside of um, io.on connection, we need to retrieve the messages list from the database and then send an event to that user. Okay, so let's do that by saying messages collection dot find and find just gets you all the messages in that collection and then we're going to convert it to array and then after that conversion happens let's do a dot n um, that's a promise so it's just passing an anonymous function here so basically what this dot n does is that it says after all these um, events here have happened okay since node.js is asynchronous um, so this returns a promise for you so you want to do a dot n and then pass in a call right here which will have the result of that um, promise okay so error and then we just have rest results uh, actually this does not take two parameters just takes one which is the list of documents that you have retrieved from this collection here okay so what we need to do is just do socket dot emit so we want to send to the current socket which is this socket here remember we're doing socket dot broadcast here which says all the sockets except this one but socket dot emit just sends to the current socket okay so we want to emit an uh, event called chart history and then what do we want to send um, as a parameter or messages for that event is just docs okay so we save that now we need to go to our main.js on the client and listen for that event so let's do our socket dot on dot on chart history so we're listening for that on the client and then let's pass in a anonymous function here and then that will take one parameter which is data and that data is the same thing that we're passing here as docs okay so we're emitting the message a chart history um, event and then we're passing in this docs here and then we're just getting this docs in the data when the client um, has that event triggered okay what we want to do is messages list dot um, find so we're gonna find all the li tags in there and then we're gonna remove that okay message dot li dot remove or we can just do messages list dot empty whichever fans is for you okay so we want to look through all the um messages inside of data here so those two dollar sign dot each which is a jquery helper and what that does is you pass it an array and since we know that data is an array it's going to loop over it and then call this function for each iteration so what we want to do is we say messages list so after we've emptied it at the top here now we want to append in all the data so we say append and then we want to append um, an li tag there and the li tag will have as text this dot text okay and let's close in the li tag okay so let's go over um, to our command line here and just restart the node.js server okay so let's wait that has um, restarted so now i will do a refresh and now um, seems like we have an error let's look in our console it says message list not defined so messages list should not be message list okay i'll just save that and refresh again now as you can see it's making a call to the server and getting all the messages and now we're populating even after restarting this uh, refreshing um, the browser likewise for firefox as well so let's send another uh, message here from firefox to chrome and say wow now we have saved messages okay so i'll just send that and as you can see it's being sent but even after refreshing the browser now the messages are retrieved from the server and are repopulated on um, our browser list of messages here okay so that brings us to the end of this video and i thank you for watching and uh, as usual if this was helpful for you or if you have any questions please leave them in the comments below i will see you soon in the next video cheers bye bye